right, it was just perfect. Not an easy rate for, for Albon, eh? because he lost... Oh, he's off the road! Sean Galeo into the gravel, and the Prima is out. And he could have had... He could have had contact there. He has had contact with Louis Delatraz. And that is going to give an opportunity, if it's a full safety car, to Artem Markelov. But right now we're focusing on De Freeze, uh, not on De Freeze, on Delatraz and Sean Galeo. The virtual safety car is deployed. And he moves under braking. Come on, it's dangerous. We're going 300 kilometers per hour. What the hell? That is so dangerous, man. Pretty decent summary of everything from Sean Galeo. Let's see if it's accurate. Here we go. Galeo, he's going to be passed, and there's the contact, just like the MP pair earlier on, and the dramatic conclusion as Galeo out in the same place Boshong was, and we've also... Oh, that is an enormous collision in terms of the implication it had at turn number one. To be honest, Galeo was, uh, was, was right. I think that Deletras made the corner without checking the inside. Yeah, I think that uh, Deletras moved. What is Galeo doing? Well, what did he do? What happened? Alongside him, and he moved on the braking and hit me. He hit me on the braking. Davide calling it the other way. They, I think when Louis says, sees that back, he won't be pleased. He was trying to squeeze him back, wasn't he? But he did make the initial contact, both drivers. Great to see they're OK, because that is pretty, pretty quick when they had the contact. Galeo out as well, and this is turning into a race of attrition at a circuit where we barely ever see any retirements. 